banana plant. It's only a little one. These things grow to about 10 feet or 3 meters or so before they start to fruit. I don't think it's going to manage it in here. Well, we've still got a bit of space left. We've also got some oranges, these decorative oranges. They're not really edible as fruit, but they do make excellent jam. We've also got some lemons. Those are quite nice. And uh, here we have a Medanilla Magnifica, and these are incredibly difficult plants to grow. Um, and they need a lot of light, and unfortunately it's a bit more than we get here in winter. So uh, I've set up this uh, 150 watt uh, daylight simulating metal halide lamp. Generates about light intensity here of about 10,000 to 20,000 lux very bright to look at so sort of noonday sun and uh, actually it's doing quite well in the last few weeks there have been a couple of new buds forming pretty good there so it, it, may, it seems to be making a difference i um, have got a few more plants we're going to try out here pineapple here that might benefit um, and uh, some crassia, uh, some uh, succulents there, um, various things we're going to be testing shortly. So there we go. Currently getting about four hours of supplementary light per day from this, and that seems to be quite sufficient. Um, this is a 6500 Kelvin full spectrum halide. Um, I've got another bulb which is a sodium and uh, we'll be trying that out as well and seeing what light is better. But there we go, supplementary plant lighting.